Here are Bible facts no one talked about. Make sure you watch till the end because the last fact will surprise you. Well, I believe you know that we live in a democratic era where elected individuals are called into power and rulership. This form of government thrives more in certain aspects of the world today. However, do you know that during the days of early man, it's biblically proven that there was a time such as theocracy, a kind of governance where God had to rule his people himself. If you read the Old Testaments of the Bible, you'd find out that God specifically chooses individuals who'll build temples and convey messages to his people. From the likes of Moses, Abraham, John the Baptist, David, Samuel, Enoch, etc. Now, do you also know that the New Testaments of the Bible came as a result of the birth of Jesus? Matter of fact, I studied closely and found out that even though God ruled based on theocracy, Jesus brought a balance to earth by introducing a new theory known as authoritarianism. Theocracy is a form of governance based on divinity, a system of government in which priests rule in the name of God or a god, whereas authoritarianism is a form of governance that people must obey completely, structured and moderated, not to be allowed to any kind of freedom to act as they wish. That is why we must accept and declare the name of Jesus in order to be saved. Hence, the birth of Jesus marked a transitional phase on earth where God had to come in form of man to educate men about personal relationship with the Father, reconcile with man again through the birth of Jesus, and introduced a new form of governance, rulership and power through Christ Jesus that is based on power and authority to communicate with the Father, cast out demons and walk in the dimension of miracles. Now I believe you understand why the name of Jesus holds so much power,